situated in the Otamanzi constituency. The school caters for the majority of formerly marginalized communities living in the area and is seen as the only hope for young learners to continue with their education. Shapanga says the curriculum implementation for Grade 7 will kick off this year at the school despite the fact that the classroom is not yet completed and the directorate will therefore put up temporary structures. The directorate is positive that if they receive a positive response from the procurement board, the council will immediately appoint a new contractor to complete the work before the end of 2017-2018 financial year. We cannot start with this hostel now. However, the grade 7 will continue. But Kids will not be accommodated in a hostel as for this academic year. Why? Because we still have to fence, we still need shower, connect to water, electrification, dining hall and kitchen. And we say, hang on, let us not rush, let's do things proper so that we, we will have little challenges. Parents and community members were unhappy about the delay in the completion of the school, saying learners have nowhere else to go after completing grade 6 at the primary school. We are highly concerned about learners who passed grade 6 set to move to grade 7. We do not want our children to drop out of school as they used to do in the past. So we are requesting that the school must be upgraded annually so that our kids remain in school because this area is very far for us to send them to other schools. Shapanga says about $4 million was set aside to complete the school hostel. He further called on residents of America and surrounding villages to enroll learners for grade 7 at the school.